<sighs> yeah. Hey, uh, you remember that nice uh, Ryobi uh, orbital sander that I had? Yeah, did you want that? You'd like to have one? Uh, I'll tell you what, I've got another one in here right now, and I've been using it for a few weeks now. Uh, come on over and uh, pick up the Ryobi sander. Yeah, it, I'll be free. Hey, hey, just come get it. Just bring your car over here, back up to the, the uh, garage. We'll load up the uh, Ryobi sander. Oh yeah, it's, it's that's uh, that's over with. Yep, you betcha. You're more than welcome. Come get it. All right. Talk to you later. Overnight. Hey, welcome to Coffee and Tools again today. Ah, uh, yeah, just like you sort of heard it. I've had this for a few weeks now, and I'll tell you what, I wanted to show it off again today. This will be the last time I show it to you, I guess. But this is the only one that is right now with the coupon code I'll give you in this description below. I think you can buy it for under $50, so that's a pretty good price. I think I paid around $40, $45, something like that for the Ryobi that I just gave away. Yeah. It's not here anymore. It's gone. This one here by Hellas, Jealous, excuse me, Jealous. This one here by Jealous is uh, doing such a great job. Love the feel of it. And the big thing is for me, there's the speed control, which we, you know, was like, yeah, okay, I usually run pretty much full out most of the time. Very rarely do I turn it down. The handle, you know, just having the handle and this nice grip and real positive on and off really do enjoy this machine. So I went over to uh, our big box store for a minute and just took a look at orbitals. Let's take a quick look. Uh, Bosch, no handle. Uh, Cobalt, uh, yeah, no handle. Uh, Craftsman, very nice, no handle. Hmm. Oh look, DeWalt, very nice, yep, no handle. Black and Decker, <laughs> no handle. Okay, before we uh, get into this uh, today. Uh, <clears throat> had something that gave away last show, which was this little guy right here, the Pocket Jig 100 from Milescraft. Nice little woodworking tool. We have a winner, ding, ding, ding. Now, I just want to say this. Uh, Jay Brackett in Colorado Springs, Colorado. Yes, you. this is being mailed out to you today. So you'll have it in a few days, you should have it. Merry Christmas or something, or Happy Turkey Day or something. The thing was, some of the people that entered the contest this time around uh, didn't put a name, just an address. Some didn't have a subject line. Uh, we had a lot of problems going through the emails trying to figure out who was in the contest and who was just writing to say hi, hey or something. So uh, the first one we came up on that was clear was uh, Jay Brackett. So he knows who he is. Uh, Mr. Brackett, congratulations, and you're getting this, like I say, in the mail because it was clear. We, we knew who, what it was and said subject line tool, and he gave his name, a nice clear address, and said, you know what, we'll send it to him. And thanks everyone else for, you know, entering. Uh, I've got more cool stuff coming up. Now, this, so the only other thing I've got right now, I have, uh, code for buying this from Amazon and it'll get you you get your discount so it'll be less than $50 uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Bear we'll call him Jeff King over there at you know the den of tools yeah he uh, he did a review on some of these and he said he wanted to get his hands on one of these so if he's watching hey buy one okay then you'll get your hands on it but <laughs> I think jealous I think he'll really be impressed and say, hey, this is nice. You know, it just feels good. You got two handles. <laughs> and, and Jealous uh, sent us over a link for a deal on these. And I, like I said, if you're thinking about an orbital or trying to bump up to something decent, I've used this for uh, several jobs in the past couple of weeks. And I'll tell you how bad it was. I actually had to clean this thing off with a cloth this morning because it was covered in sawdust and everything else that I've been working on in the last few weeks. But this has been my, this is my new go-to, you know, orbital sander because it's working great. And I really do love it. It is, I think that for a few more dollars than some of those cheap ones you see at the big box stores, with that handle 
and just the way it works and the way it feels in your hands and stuff and the way it runs smooth I think it's a better you know it's just a better beast for the time being and I think it's just worth that a little bit more money you may have to pay to say buy the Jealous as opposed to the other ones that are at the big box stores and let's see the other thing while I was at the big box store I also went over to Lowe's I actually went to Home Depot and Lowe's yep it's as if the pain wasn't enough right to have to go to one but I uh, found this over at Lowe's this week and if you can if you're looking for 12 inch blades this is two of them and you've got the 32 tooth for like general rough cut or general purpose you also have the 80 for like cabinet and trim work and you know cool stuff like that the two of them for $39 what a great deal so hopefully you guys if you you know if you're thinking about it run over to Lowe's you can find these now they're 12 inch yeah with the uh, one inch arbor and that is a I think that's a terrific deal from DeWalt DeWalt makes pretty good stuff so you know I don't have a problem with that just thought I'd share that with you. Now, like I said, down below the, will be a link. There'll also be a link for a discount code that you can use when checking out. If you decide to order a t-shirt or a coffee mug from us this week, we're gonna include it all the way to the end of uh, November. So the whole month, you can get a uh, 10% discount on t-shirts, coffee mugs from, of course, who else? Coffee and Tools. In other news, uh, last week I released the dark side of the table saw, so the other side of thinking or the other old school thinking really is what it is because this day and age everything seems to be, you know, safety, safety, safety. And that's, you know, that's the way it is. That's cool. But uh, I decided I would, you know, let's take a look at what some of the old training, you know, things that we used to be shown or told and how it's sort of like it's, you know, we still carry on those traditions, but yeah, they're not safe tra traditions. But I want to thank everyone so far that's put input, comments. I think we're going to have to do something about the, the top 10 safety tips or just uh, tricks and tips around uh, table saws. We got to get back to this table saw anyways. There's lots of more, there's a lot more material uh, involved there. And just want to thank everyone for their input and for viewing, of course, and taking a look. We've got huge outpouring of uh, emails and what have you about the table saw situation and a lot of guys that I could like man I can connect with these guys because I'm they know what I'm talking about they were there it happened for them too meantime uh, I gotta tell you uh, at the end of the show we always do it and I guess we'll do it again yeah please like <laughs> share and subscribe and thank you again so much for watching and viewing coffee and tools and what's going on in the garage this week <laughs> over and out <laughs>